And now, turning to the world's largest handset maker, Nokia said it will acquire total ownership of operating system company Symbian, buying out current partners in a deal valued at about $411 million. Nokia said it will combine its own S60 platform with the Symbian platform and provide the results, a single smartphone operating system, without charge to the former owners. The new Symbian Foundation will oversee the platform. Nokia's Kai Astamo explained what the deal means for the company. For us, the Symbian platform will offer greater efficiency and let us, let us reach more consumers with converged devices while maintaining the platform consistency, which then is a, the, the, the fuel for innovation, fuel for application development, will act as a magnet for application developers to develop on top of the new Symbian Foundation code line. The, this platform provides critical mass like no other. Again, the 200 million users out there today, 4 million application developers existing today. It is most proven, most mature platform in the ecosystem. However, Nokia's Symbian effort will face stiff competition from the likes of Google's Android, the LIMO Foundation's Linux platform, Microsoft Windows mobile operating system, RIM's BlackBerry offering, Apple's iPhone platform, and a host of smaller competitors. Analyst Jeff Blaber at CCS Insights summed up Nokia's acquisition of Symbian by saying, quote, is it too late? For its part, Nokia expects the deal to close in the fourth quarter.